so I went to go meet up with the subby to give her some of the extra stuff that I had from um that was given to me by my subby Adana. She was so amazing. She gave me so much stuff and there was tons of storage, so I shared some of it. So let me show you. Um we met up in a Hobby Lobby parking lot because I went looking for the clearance paint, but my store hadn't marked them down yet, so um, we are leaving this morning to Disneyland, so I'm hoping that I can escape and go shopping out there. But when my dad goes, it's really hard because sometimes he's picky and he's like, no, don't leave, you know. So hopefully, <laughs> yeah, it sounds so bad, but I'm like, I'm hoping that he'll get tired that I can run back, you know, when he goes back to the room to like rest that I can run out the door and go shopping. So we'll see. There may be a video coming on that. So let me share with you guys what I found at Hobby Lobby. Um... The St. Patrick's Day stuff is finally 90% off. So I found this guy and I know that it has a shamrock, but I'm thinking I could use this for anything. So I'm going to try to like cut the shape out, like trace it on paper and just kind of like layer it up with paper. So this guy was 59 cents and 90% off. And then I got one of these shamrocks and this was 29 cents. And I use this side because I already own one of these. So I like that it's reversible, but this like leopard print is not my style. So I used this side and I just had it plain. So I picked up one more so that way I can have two of them. They had quite a bit of these and I was going to get all of them because I figured, you know, I could like alter them, but I didn't. So I don't know if I see more, I might pick up more because afterwards I started regretting like, oh, I should have just got the other ones. And then, you know, I could always like alter them and gift them next year. So I don't know if I see more I'll probably pick up more because like they're beautiful and if you just go ahead and get like a little leprechaun here you know or a little pot of gold and like decorate it so I should have got them so yeah like I said if I find more I'll probably get some more of those and then I found these little hats I thought these were so stinking cute so these came out to 29 cents and they just have the little pick to put like with your um floral arrangement so yeah I thought those were super cute and it does have a little gold ribbon so yeah, for that price, I figured why not? Okay, I was so, so amazed to find this because it's Valentine's Day and I've been to the store once a week, if not more sometimes, since Valentine's Day and look, it was 39 cents and you guys know how obsessed I am with coffee. I actually have my iced coffee in the other room right now because we are getting ready to leave. So yes, I am so obsessed. I'm going to add some little rhinestone hearts to these little areas just to bling it up. Oh my gosh. I honestly want to leave this out all year long. I think I am. I think I'm going to go and just leave it out all year because it's just so, so pretty. I love it. 40 cents. I couldn't believe it. Then they had ribbon. So this came out to 59 cents and it's just glittery two-toned. Sorry, sorry. Choking um so two-tone glitter love that so pretty and i found one of these again i think it's so pretty i again i could probably decorate it like uh make like a little saint patrick's day banner to like go across the front i thought would be really cute um 29 cents they only had one of those i would have got more because i love this one this was 59 cents and again just some glittery shamrock ribbon really pretty and i found these pens so um 24 cents and there are two pens and it's red ink which i thought was really really nice so i figured i could save these for like christmas time when i do my christmas cards and use this red ink so I got those. I'm going to stick those in. I have a cup over there full of pens. I have multiple cups full of pens. Let me just tell you guys. I love cups. Um, I found some more um, patches. So these are different than the ones I had previously got. So these were $2.24. So I have the Incredibles and then I have Sven and Olaf right here. So um, I would love to have a jean jacket one day full of all the Disney patches that I've been collecting. So one day I will. When I go to the thrift stores, I do look to see if there's any kind of like jean jacket that I like. But so far, the styles that I've liked haven't been in my size. They're always too small. So I'll keep looking. I know it will pop up one day. 
Um, these were in the baby section. So these are 62 cents and I bought three because I've been talking about it for so long, like for a couple months now that I want to make a junk journal for the first time. And I've kind of started putting one together, but I haven't finished it. Like I tell you guys, I have like 10 projects that are started, but not done. Um, so a junk journal is one of them. So I thought that after I'm done creating my little junk journal that I could use these as the band to go around the, um, the junk journal, the journal. So I thought these would be really pretty. And then, you know, I can add like a little flower or a rosette or something, you know, to the band. So I figured for that price, why not? So there's three to each. There is a pink, a white and a black. So yeah, so I'm going to use those for like little book bands. So I got those. Um, I found some paper clips. These are 49 cents. So again, for the junk journals or for any kind of like vintage, because they kind of are like, um, not like a dark gold or like a light kind of gold, if that makes sense. So I thought those were pretty. And then um, these were 74 cents. So I bought four of them. And they are just like the little alligator clips to make like little barrettes for the baby's hair. But for, I think it was my Valentine's Day swap, somebody had made like little embellishments out of these. So they wrapped ribbon on the metal part and then they did, I think it was like a little flower with a heart. So um, that was part of like the back topper. So you could actually remove the little clip and then this was just plain paper. So I like that you can use it, you know, on anything that it came off and on. So these have 20 pieces. So I bought four of those and trust me, there was plenty left in the store when I left. So my total was $13 for all this stuff, $13 and 18 cents. So I, that is a freaking amazing deal. Like these patches alone are expensive. These are, what would that have been? $16 alone just for these. And instead I got all of this for $13. So you guys, you can't beat these clearance prices at Hobby Lobby. Like, after clearance is over, I'm going to try so hard not to buy anymore and just wait until the next clearance, which usually happens around August because I just have so much stuff. I need to finish going through everything. I need to finish de-stashing some stuff. So, yeah, I'm just really, really excited to get back into crafting with you guys. So, I'm still going to do my embellishment box swap. I haven't finished like adding the stuff to it. I finished the cover, but I haven't finished filling it. It's just been taking me longer than I thought. So that is still going to happen. So um, stay tuned for that video. Hopefully you guys have seen the boxes that I showed that are the ones you have to use. They're in the craft section of Dollar Tree. And then um, I'm going to ask to not sell like a bunch of bulky extra because I'm trying to get them to fit into the flat rate envelopes. So hopefully you guys got those boxes. Hopefully you guys have been working on it. And that's pretty much it. Oh, um, I was going to do some happy mail because I got quite a bit but maybe I will do that I'll do that in another video because there is quite a bit of the happy mail stuff so okay that is it for now you guys you guys have an amazing time an amazing weekend we are heading out the door soon I'm just waiting for my dad to get back from Dallas and we are out the door to Disney and I'm so excited so all right guys there will be um some videos that will still be coming up on my channel even though I'm gone I have stuff pre-recorded and loaded up as well. So, all right. Bye, guys.